What's going on everyone, E-Pac-Mans is back with another Fortnite video and today we will be looking at Season 8, Week 8 challenges and based on the leaks that I saw yesterday, they seem to look pretty cool. But before I get started as usual, I just want to thank you guys. Um, thank you for 1,300 subscribers at the moment. I really appreciate each and every one of you. And if you haven't subscribed already, what are you doing? Make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on that bell button so you don't miss out on any future posts like this one. And then I also want to say that I will be doing the shoutouts at the end of this video, so make sure you guys stay tuned. And then last but not least, as you guys already know, I do have a supporter creator code now. And when you go to the item store, it is at the bottom right hand corner. Support a creator, and then that's my code, EPACMANS, all capitalized. So if you guys feel like supporting me, go ahead, hit that code, and then screenshot when you buy the item, and I will give you guys a shout out. So other than that, let's look into week eight. So here's the first stage challenge. So stage one of two, search the treasure map, signpost found in Paradise Palms. Okay, so that's stage one. All right, not too bad. Then we have used vending machines in different matches, so it looks like three matches, okay, not too bad. Deal damage to opponents while using at least one balloon. And then for the battle pass challenges, we have search jigsaw puzzle pieces under bridges and caves, okay. So it looks like seven different locations at least. It's going to be tougher, but um, so far these challenges are looking pretty cool. And then we have stage one of two, dial the Dur Burger number on the big telephone west of Fatal Fields. Okay, so that's stage one of two. We will be dialing the third burger number once we find the telephone. Then we have to eliminate opponents at Dusty Divot or Lucky Landing. That standard seven opponents shouldn't be too bad at all. And we have eliminate an opponent from at least 50 meters away. You guys know my sniper skills have been pretty solid this season. That should not be a problem. But let's go take a look at the game modes that they have available right now. So that's the problem right now, that they don't have Team Rumble, so this might not be as easy as usual. Meaning, I'm probably going to have to do some solos or something to knock these challenges out. So, that being said, that might make this week a little tougher, but it's okay. Alright guys, so I'm going to be playing with one of my friends this morning, XXJuice42XX. We're going to be doing some duos and hopefully knock these challenges out pretty quick and I also want to say guys before I forget once you do these challenges assuming you've done them all before you're gonna unlock ruin this week so that's gonna be dope and ruin looks really cool and then you can access his back bling and this pickaxe which looks pretty cool so that so these challenges are gonna be available once you unlock ruin but ruin himself on the discovery is gonna be unlocked right after 55 weekly challenges so assuming you guys did them all you're gonna unlock this guy alright guys we switched the game mode um, duos was not the move alright guys so you guys can see this is where you're gonna find the Dur Burger telephone right west of Fatal Fields and we changed the game mode, like I said. There's no Team Rumble this time, but at least this is going to favor us. And I'm going to show you guys what you have to do once you guys land there. Alright guys, so once you get here, this is what you have to do. And I'm going to do it quick because the storm's coming. So, five, 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 zero, one, five, Two. And that should work. There you go. You guys see it? Awesome. So remember, when you guys land here, you can't just pickaxe at it because nothing's going to happen. You have to dial 5550152. And then you guys will dial the Dur Burger. So now, guys, we're going to dial the Pizza Pit number on the big telephone east of the block. So let's go see if we can find that. Okay, guys, so right where I marked like right around here that's where we're gonna have to go but we need a weapon first just so we can you know shoot at the numbers it'll it's a lot easier if you just shoot at the numbers so i'm gonna go get a quick weapon or two 
but here is the telephone and then again it's gonna be right in the middle the number you have to dial as you guys can see it's five 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 zero one nine eight so let's go ahead and do that five 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 zero one nine eight and there we go we got credit for dialing pizza pit all right, let's see if we can snipe somebody, guys, just so I can get that 50 meter credit. There we go. Finally. Oh, I need two opponents. I didn't even realize. Okay. Two opponents. Oh, my God. I missed him by a hair. I got one shot left, guys. There we go. We got him. Just in time with one shot left, I was able to do it. That was clutch. I think somewhere over here there's there's a bridge that I have to search. A jigsaw puzzle under. Oh, there it is. Okay. Here is the cave. Exactly. And here's the jigsaw puzzle. So that's one out of seven, I believe. Yes. So I'm going to mark my location, guys, so you guys can see. Right by Tilted Towers, right here, this little cave. Okay, we're going to go to the umbrella here. There should be another jigsaw somewhere around this area. Well, actually, I know exactly where. Right here it should be. But we'll take a look just to see. And this will be our jigsaw number two. Just remember, you're looking for caves, and this is a cave down here. Rest in peace, Motel, by the way. I, I love Motel. And then I would always come here for mats. But. Oh, there's the jigsaw puzzle. So here's number two. We got another cave over here in the desert biome. Over here, yeah. Okay. So again, guys, there's another piece. And then just so you guys know, even though I'm running out of time, right over here. And we're going to go see maybe. I have time to make it over here and see if we could outdo the storm oh it's this cave okay so here's the cave over here we should find the third jigsaw and there we go right here so take a look right here right by fatal fields and then let's go over here kind of towards a circle can find something over there. And there it is actually, right here. Shout out to my teammate. He found it for me actually. And that is right here at the edge. You guys can see. Okay, we're gonna land. Let's see, we'll land right here. There's a bridge right here as you guys can see. Just north of Lucky. Or north, a little northeast, or northwest. It's a little northwest of Lucky Landing right here, as you guys can see. We're gonna land right here, right away. A little hot drop, and then we're gonna get there before the lava gets there, because I don't know if you guys can see, but the lava is creeping into that river. Okay, so now we are gonna head all the way up here, the desert. Okay, so where is the jigsaw puzzle though? Oh, there we go. Here it is. And then, there we go. Oh, that's not what I expected it at all to be, but okay, I will take it. We have finished that challenge. Seven out of seven. Search jigsaw puzzle pieces under bridges and caves. Alright, guys, so I have another friend joining me today, and it's D Nunez6. And we're going to be doing the stage one of two search the treasure map signpost found in Paradise Palm. So I will let you guys know where that is here in a sec. Okay guys, we're going to be looking at the signpost in Paradise Palms, which should be right around here. So make sure you guys go over there if you guys are looking for the signpost right over here, Paradise Palms. I'm going to try and land right on the post because this is a hot drop and I already know there's going to be... I can already see like three guys. 
I'm gonna get this gun just in case. And here's the sign, guys. Like I said, just search that, and that's that. Alright guys, for stage 202, follow the treasure map signpost in Paradise Palms, which means that signpost that we just got, we have to go to a different location that it was pointing towards, which I will show you guys here in a sec. Alright guys, so where we're gonna go, we're gonna go over here, check out this area for where we have to follow the treasure map signpost in Paradise Palms. It should lead us over here to... I know it's in Frosty Flights area, but we're going to check out exactly where and I'll let you guys know. Okay, you guys see it right here? So right at the end of the trail, we're just going to search this. And then like I said, right over here where we are, you can't miss it. Alright guys, just a reminder, if if you guys are playing with, the, uh, with one of your friends, just have that party assist on and it makes it go a lot quicker. There's another guy by me then. No! He's a one shot. He got me, but he's a one shot. Nice. And that's why you guys party assist, ladies and gentlemen. Nice! Good stuff, my dude. Okay, I see him. He's over here. I hit him. No way! He got him this thing. That's crazy. Well, there he, there he goes, though. He messed up for letting it overheat. No way! He pumped me! One pump! There you go. Eliminate him. Nice. That's six. Oh, you got him? Nice. Oh, and there's one right here. A gold one, too. What do I want? Pump, pump, or uh, infantry. I think I'm gonna get a pump. And that's one of three, so remember guys, you gotta use a um, vending machine in three different matches for it to count. My second vending machine. Do you want anything since you found it? Oh yeah, true. Alright, that's two out of three guys. Okay, so we just completed a 3 out of 3, use different vending machines, use vending machines in different matches. Oh, guys, check this out. I just got, so I finished the discovery challenges and it just got ruined. And if you ask me, Rune is pretty tough looking. I like it. That's a pretty good skin and it reminds me of Omega, not gonna lie. So, real quick, let's peep the Ruin challenges because Ruin has challenges. And then it says destroy trees, so I have to destroy 50 trees, destroy 35 rocks, 20 cars, trucks, or RVs, deal up 10,000 damage to opponent structures, and then outlast a thousand opponents. Oh, my bad. There's more. Complete daily challenges, which is five. This is easy. And then remember, guys, you get this back bling, uh, this day dying light backpack, which is awesome. And then you get this pickaxe over here. That's a cool skin. I'm gonna equip it right now and hopefully knock some of these challenges out of the way. So, for these challenges, um, I'm just gonna knock a few out. You guys already know you have to destroy 50 trees, guys. I'm not gonna walk you guys through. I'm pretty sure you guys know how to destroy trees. Okay, so technically I'm using a balloon and I did damage. Oh, look at that! I got it! I actually got credit. This is what I'm talking about. So I literally knocked a guy while I was using that one balloon. That had to be the easiest. You know, I thought it was going to be the hardest challenge, but this honestly was the easiest. 
Okay guys, now that we have done all of Season 8, Week 8 challenges, we're gonna go take a look and see where the Battlestar slash Banner is going to be at. So first, this is the Week 8 loading screen. Welcome to Ruin. You see him there. Alright, so based on this loading screen, we can see. Or maybe not so clearly here on the screen, but we see B6, C6, B7, C7. And so, we're going to go to the intersection of those four coordinates. So B6, C6, B7, C7. Oh, there it is. So we got the banner right here again. C6, B6, C7. We got it. And right before I got shot down, I'm just going to let him shoot me. That is it for week 8 of season 8. Challenges and secret banner. I hope you guys all did enjoy. Make sure if you did, drop a like on this video. And subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Also, turn on that bell button so you don't miss out on any future posts like this one. And then guys, comment down below any other videos you guys would like to see that aren't Fortnite challenges. You know, maybe like some vlogs or other challenge videos that I could do with some friends. You guys let me know down below. And then obviously before I leave, I'm going to give you guys the shoutouts that I promised you from last week for my thousand subscribers. Once again, thank you very much. So here are my shoutouts from the comment section of my YouTube video of you guys saying that you guys were subscribed or done with what I had asked. I'm going to give you guys a shout outs, but before I do, I do apologize if I mispronounce your name on the accident. You know, I'm not perfect, so just bear with me, guys. So first shout out, Thane Too Great. Shout out to you, my dude. Brandon Clark, shout out to you. Shout out to the newbie Godmaster, underscore 263. Shout out to Mr. Fresh English. Shout out to bboy99, I'm best, 111. Shout out to Rhiannon Styles. Shout out to Metal Mocha. Shout out to Darwis Luna. Shout out to Maximus Prodidus, I believe. Shout out to JP the Goat. Shout out to Landon Brummel. Okay, and that is and that looks like that's it from my YouTube video itself from the comment section. Let's go to look at my Instagram. I think I had a few there that I want to shout out. Shout out to Pitcher Punch ST. Shout out to your underscore boy underscore jonesy so those are a couple guys that i want to shout out from instagram which have used my support a creator code so shout out to all of you guys and if i missed you let me know down below that if i missed you and i will try to make sure to get you in the next video but um for future shout outs i do want to give at least one shout out per video and all you have to do is just like I said, subscribe, turn on that bell button, let me know you've done it. You can screenshot you guys supporting me on Support a Creator, and I will definitely give you guys a shout out. So thank you all for your support, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.